morning, everybody. It is Thursday, May 18th, 2023. Uh, Mark <laughs> Maderman Seaton, Delmer and Sir Charles. We're once again back at Elk Garden where the AT crosses. We're going to take the horse trail up to Briar Ridge Meadow and we're going to uh, pick some wild edibles on the way back down. It is uh, freezing cold. So we got to get moving and get some blood flowing. So will not y'all come along with us? Let's get going. Heading up the uh, Virginia Highlands Horse Trail towards uh, Briar Ridge Meadow, <laughs> which is up there. Delmer and me were just through here two weeks ago today uh, on our overnighter. And it was, uh, if I recall, sunny and mild temperatures. It's in the mid 40s here. I guess that wind chill probably put it upper 30s. Uh, as you can see, it's really overcast. You can't even see the tallest mountains back over that way. Weather can change on a dime up here. I've been, a, I've been up here in July and August and it'd be uh, be really chilly. You should be able to hear the wind. Sun's supposed to break through later. Hope so. Time we get up out of the meadow because uh, that's one of my favorite spots to go to. You get some get some awesome views from up there. We're probably about a half mile or so from the top, Briar Ridge Meadow. Sun's trying to peek through the clouds. Winds died down quite a bit. A little too uh, windy and chilly to stay up here very long. Anyway, I've probably mentioned this before. This is one of my favorite spots in the NRA. Back over there is where the uh, Appalachian Trail goes. Thomas Knob Shelters back over about right in there. Yeah, like I mentioned in the intro, uh, it's kind of a twofold purpose today. Get a hike in and uh, we're gonna harvest some uh, ramps on the way back down. Probably be our only chance for the year. They're already starting to turn yellow, the leaves. After that, they bend over flat and they're harder to find.
trail continues down that way. Cabin Ridge Trail is down that way. Right up there, if you make out that fence line, past these two big boulders, that's where you get back on the, on the Appalachian Trail. It's just too windy to stay up here very long, so we're going to head back down into the tree line and have some lunch somewhere. GoPro probably won't pick it up, but right over in there is where we're parked. That's two and a half miles from here. All right, everybody, we are getting close to the parking lot. Now look what a beautiful day it turned out to be. Uh, we didn't stay long on top because of the wind. We came back down to Deep Gap, and between all three of us, we probably got 15 pounds of ramps. And I also got some stinging nettle, which is uh, good for arthritis. My wife suffers from arthritis. So, uh, oh, before I forget, <laughs> Ran into fellow YouTuber, RVA Hiker Girl. Had a real nice chat with her. It's the first time I'd ever met her. We chatted for about 15 or 20 minutes and I didn't have enough sense to even think to get her on video. So anyway, if you happen to watch this, RVA Hiker Girl, it was a pleasure meeting you. Uh, thanks for coming along with us. As always, there's another one in the books. Until next time. Thank you.